Health Talk, brought to you by Rapids Regional Medical Center. Robin Casenza was a busy mom of eight-year-old Michael and four-year-old Layla. And like any mom, there were times when she was tired, really tired. But when Robin couldn't keep up with her son during a short walk around their neighborhood, she knew something was wrong. It started when I was pregnant with my daughter uh, about four years ago, and um, it got better. And then uh, last spring, um, the symptoms started um, and just kept persisting. It became more and more intense. And I, <laughs> I thought, you know, at first, am I really that out of shape? Robin saw a cardiologist and had several tests before they discovered the reason for her heart palpitations and breathlessness. Through an echocardiogram, they found out that I had uh, the hole in my heart. Because of the hole's size and location, it first seemed as if Robin would need open heart surgery. The other option was to do it um, via catheter. Um, where they go in through the vein in your leg and they insert a, a real tiny catheter um, into your heart and they, uh, they repair the hole that way. Robin's cardiologist, Dr. Alan Yunus, brought in a colleague from California to offer advice during the procedure. Ms. Cosenza had an atrial septal defect. Uh, that means a hole between the two upper chambers in the heart. The treatment of choice actually is a transcatheter procedure that we did on Mrs. Cosenza. It is a great way of fixing that defect, comparing this to open heart surgery where you have to have the chest open. I feel better all the way around. Um, it's little things yet big things at the same time. For more information about Rapids Regional Heart Hospital services, call 877-801-8441.